was rather hoping you'd talk. I've no idea what condition the battery's in. Is it? Oh. Hi guys. I've picked up this multi voice changer toy in a charity shop the other day. Um, I did show it in the charity shop gold all garbage video, and I did give it to my grandson to try, and it's rubbish. It doesn't work. I had hoped it was just the battery was flat but the battery is absolutely fine. It just doesn't work. Um, testing, one, two, three, four. That was testing one, two, three, four, in case you didn't get it. So the next thing is, it's. I'm hoping it might be the microphone or the speaker that needs fixing. With a bit of luck, it might just be the microphone where we've had uh, little children spitting in it or something like that. So we'll take it apart and have a look. If nothing else, we can have a look inside anyway and just see what components are used. Not making much progress here at the moment. I've tried two different microphones and that hasn't made any significant improvement so I've put the original one back on again. I've tried two different speakers and that doesn't seem to have made much difference. Maybe a tiny bit of difference but nothing really significant. But I've just disconnected the LEDs and it does actually sound clearer now. I should put it back together now. All I've done in effect is re-soldered the main wiring points. So I've re-soldered the microphone wires Resoldered the speaker wires, resoldered the LED wires, I've even resoldered the battery wires. And that seems to be a bit clearer. It's still pretty rubbish, but it's better than it was. So I'll, I'll put it back together and we'll try it. Just hold it for now. Start it with everything switched off. Okay. I think that's Dalek sound. Obviously, drops the voice. One, two, three, four. Well, that sounds Dalek as well. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Well, it sounds better than it did. It's still pretty rubbish, but. Um, I can actually make out what I'm saying now, so I'll screw it all back together. All the screws back in place. I'm sure my grandchildren will still like it 
I would say it was pretty well rubbish, but it only cost me 75 pence anyway. And we can vary the sounds by having a selection of these switches thrown. So, well, it sort of works. And all I've done is, as I say, freshened up the solder joints. All my extra effort was a waste of time.